We've all been warned about the effects of secondhand smoking on people and especially children, but what about our pets? A Montgomery author is spreading awareness about the dangers secondhand smoking can have on pets after losing a dog because of it. WSFA 12 News reporter Demetria Connor has more. Cookie girl? Yes. This is a good girl. Montgomery resident Marcella Bickerstaff has been a dog lover since the age of two. I've had a total of 100 dogs. Now she's the owner of four dogs, including these two, Icky and Cautious. Love your animals because they're very sensitive and they really have, dog really is God spelled backwards because dogs love unconditionally and they have the heart of, of God. That passion for dogs and the loss of a dog to secondhand smoke inspired Bigger Staff to write a book titled Dog is God spelled backwards. Every limp node was filled with tar. Her lungs looked like the lungs of a smoker. Even though the dog she found and kept died 15 years ago, she still remembers it like it was yesterday. Before she died, she started having shortness of breath. See, they can't tell us what's wrong with them. And so when we're, somebody's puffing on a cigarette smoke, is going straight to that dog or that cat. Doctors say secondhand smoking is linked to cancers, allergies, skin diseases, and respiratory problems in dogs and cats. So that's another reason for people to stop smoking if they know that it's affecting their dogs or their cats too. Spreading awareness to those pet owners that could be harming their furry pals. Animals are more sensitive than people too and people don't know that. Bickerstaff challenges smokers to think about the effects not only on other people, but animals the next time they light up. Demetria Connor, WSFA 12 News, Montgomery.